What's your next big assignment, Blit? You're going to take JD out to France. The real France? The real, the real Paris France. Are you freaking out, JD? Because you don't like to travel. You're like me. First of all, it's I'd be better if it was an English speaking country. I'm I don't like to not go to places where I don't know how to speak English. So I'm a little nervous about that. And of course, Blit knows French and uh, he won't tell me anything of what we're doing. So, I don't, know, I, don't, I, don't, I don't know what to expect. I got some uh, tape of JD learning French. They actually hooked him up with an instructor. I didn't think he did too bad, but I don't know. <laughs> uh, I, 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 I don't know. I don't know much still. I need to study more. <laughs> things, got, uh, you know. things got off to a rocky start. Here's JD. Immediately found out something about Parisian culture that he didn't like. Here you go. Bonjour, JD. How are you today? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I'm good. I don't know. Uh, so you're starting from scratch, right? You don't know any French? I know. I like. I know Merci. I know. Uh, yeah, bonjour. <laughs> After six p.m., you know what you have to say? It's, uh, no, no. Bonsoir, and it's what we call l'heure de l'apéro. Oh my God, <laughs> le. L'heure de l'apéro. Ah, fuck. L'heure de l'apéro. L'heure de l'apéro. Excellent. Take your time. L'heure de l'apéro. L'apéro. Apéro. 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 L'apéro is short for aperitif. Aperitif. Before dinner, we eat later, right? More like eight or nine. Oh, we, whoa, whoa, hold on. I'm not going to eat dinner till eight or nine when I'm there? Usually, it's what it is. Oh, no, yeah. do like restaurants not open until like... The first service, usually it's more seven, eight. It's very American to like maybe have dinner, you know, five, six. Yeah, that's, my, that's, my, that's about my dinner time. But it's why we have apéro. Oh, no. <laughs> a French accent isn't, isn't the same as speaking French. You can't just, like, speak English and go, hey, how you doing? Yeah, they don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Oh, listen, I did, I'm trying to, trying to, you know, uh, be it's familiar. It's good. I don't know. <laughs> 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 ah, French fry. The instructor tried to teach JD how to tell people what he does for a living anybody want to hear uh, that or have you had enough? well did she find out what he did, does <laughs> <laughs> i hope she tells me if i say qu'est-ce que tu fais comme travail what do you do as work and you want to say oh i am je suis uh, I, uh je suis je suis mm -hmm. um radio uh i don't know what radio in, in french is radio host je, je suis radio host excellent je suis je suis présentateur Radio. I am radio host. Host. Okay. Je suis présentateur. Fuck. I fucked that up. Je suis présentateur. Je suis présentateur. Fuck. Tato. Radio. Radio. Excellent. She says excellent to anything he says. Yeah. Uh, she's trying to be encouraging. I, God JD. bless her. Are you yes. so out of shape that you're exhausted from just talking? Because you're like, My, uh, uh, just, uh, <laughs> je suis la mumbler. <laughs> I, I, I'm I'm out of shape, but the, the just the amount of just the level of words and how to say them or whatever, like. I was stressed Sorry. out. I had two lessons. I was stressed out after each one. Howard, he broke I, a sweat uh, during both yeah. lessons. Oh, sweat. Yeah. I had a headache. I was like, <laughs> Blit wanted to talk to me afterwards, and I was like, I can't do it. I, I don't want to do it. <laughs> JD is uh, very worried about getting lost in the city, too. That came out uh, during the you lesson. You might be lost at some point in Paris. You want to ask, you know? God, don't even, you know what? Don't even put that in my head. I don't even want to think about that. <laughs> If if I get lost in Paris, I'm done for. I'm not. I won't make myself. I won't make it back to America. That's pretty much. It's a given. I'm gonna. I'm just gonna get kidnapped somewhere or something. Sorry. If you're looking for your street, excusez-moi. Où se trouve la rue de Rivoli? Right. Oh my gosh, la rue de Rivoli. <laughs> Ibbity bibbity. <laughs> Jeez, JD, you sound miserable in that lesson. I mean, that's a hard language. John has taken JD to a swanky French bistro in Paris and wants JD to to, to do all of his own ordering in French. Uh oh. Uh -oh. 
So the instructor went over some of the basic restaurant vocabulary with JD, and that went equally horrible. When you enter the restaurant, what are you going to say? Bonsoir, uh, monsieur, table for two? <laughs> You're going to have to ask the menu. Je peux voir la carte, s'il vous plaît. Je peux, je, je peux, je peux, je, je peux. Maybe you're going to have a little bread. Panière de pain. Ah, fuck. Da, 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 du, du, du. Una panière de pain. De, de pain. Shit. Uh, pepe le pipi poo poo. <laughs> uh, pepe, pepe le pew. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, I can't wait to hear about that trip. Mm -hmm. Oh, my yeah. God.